Oke lo guys, gue sedikit lo gampang sedikit Oke lo guys, gue sedikit lo gampang sedikit channel dan sekarang um, I'm playing Life Strange again But I don't give a fuck, kalau misalkan kameranya mati, ini uh, HP gue mati, ini bakal hijau ujungnya Ini baterai tinggal 10% dan Mungkin kalian tinggal lihat suara gue Miss no. Price, what, what the fuck? how good of you to join us I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner uh, and then dihukum. Just mereka dihukum. Sorry. Gara-gara bolos. Ya. Yeah. Enggak ikut ulangan. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. was violated... Reality check time. Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um, what? Uh, Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Uh... D? Are you asking, or is that rhetorical? Disrespectfulness. We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. We did? In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. At the Despite Academy. all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Witnesses saying you were involved in bullying Nathan Prescott. The, the hell I was! I stood up for that little weirdo. I suppose that's one interpretation of events. Say what you will about my daughter, but she is not a bully. Yeah. Mom. Maybe you should be talking to Drew you're instead of right. me. You know, the you guy know. who actually did what you're yeah, accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. And Chloe's situation is less sensitive? I do not discuss other students' situations. We are here to discuss your daughter and her actions. Convenient. Reserve mom comes well. Principal Wells, I know this looks bad. Thank you for your validation, Miss Price. May I continue? With your permission? Okay, bitch. Sorry. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. Any of it? We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. Okay. What does that mean? It means... You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I made her do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was, Chloe afraid. was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? For what? For what? You didn't do anything. Your willingness to stand by me, even now, is truly inspiring. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Wow, acting right. Miss Price. Miss Price. Yeah, fine. Bullshit. Fine, yes. It was her idea. But it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, 
Based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Yeah, but when you fling Ray! Through. Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or... Coerce her? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of why someone like Rachel... Oh, I think we're clear, Principal Wells. Someone like Rachel, but not my daughter. No. Excuse me? Okay. Do you have a list of students you assume the worst about? Cut her on. Good. Enjoy the show. You have no right to treat Chloe this way. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? Let's all just calm down. After everything we... She's been through in the last two years. You should be ashamed of yourself. Miss Price. Mrs. Price. Mrs. Price. I appreciate your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. Okay. I understand, Mr. Wells. There's there is no, no doubt, doubt that, that Chloe's Christmas behavior must improve. improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss yeah. Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. No. The performance is tonight. What the performance is tonight? For someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances. Accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy... Victoria Chase. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. That is what such... What was that, Miss Price? <sighs> Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next. Unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Gola? <sighs> no. Nothing to add. I'm glad. Though Chloe may not have been the mastermind of yesterday's events, it was, as I prefaced, the proverbial last straw. In light of your many past transgressions, I have no choice but to suspend you for the rest of the year. But it was the other girl's idea. She confessed. And she will be punished accordingly. But that does not absolve Chloe of her responsibility. I am truly sorry it has come to this. But Chloe will have the chance for reinstatement in the fall. Her actions, beginning now, will be weighed heavily in that decision. Do you understand me? Both of you. Yeah. I mean... As much as I ever do. Chloe? We understand, Mr. Wells. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. Huh? That this is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. Come on, Chloe. What the fuck itu ibunya pakai celemek ke sekolah ya dan Oke, bitch We are in the hall I'm sorry, I'm sorry too Not me at the junkyard later? You bet What the fuck? It's okay, come on I didn't get the chance to introduce myself I'm Joyce Mrs. Price 
I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. Okay. We really should be going. Nice to nice meet, to meet you. you. Okay. Nice to meet you too, bitch. No. Mom, I'm I'll see you in the parking lot. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Oh, skip. Hey, skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Sorry that my totally fair and impartial and hearing inconvenienced you, man. Man. Okay, man. Secure the bitch. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. A photo doodle, chemistry book, signatures, a pencil case? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, uh, okay. Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. A sick. You've served me well. Sick chemistry. Oh, the buang buku kimia nyanyi. Trash. A locker. Having Justin as my locker neighbor was one of the few n I had big plans for adding to this collage. Oh well. Okay. Take. Ah, ada peto minyong. Ada peto minyong. Minyong minyong. Wah lucu minyongnya. Gedot. Ada peto minyong minyong. Minyong minyong lucu. Okay, trash. Book. Just trash that. Um, pencil case. Too. Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. You've served me. I should write a poem to mark the occasion. Absolutely, positively, the best concert of two thousand eight. Okay. Trash this. Finally, what I actually came here for. Ah, lu bangap it. Free trip. Jackpot. Jackpot. Wait. What the, what the hell? hell? Damn her. it, Justin. Chloe, hey yo, had to borrow your stash. Desperate times, you know. Promise, I'll get you back next week, Justin. What the fuck? What is that? Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me... Wait, calm down, bitch. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool. Cool. <sighs> okay, but try to make it fast, will you? Okay, we go ahead and look up any. Okay, you bad girl. Really, really fucking you bad girl. Baru mulai. Fuck that shit. Awas, 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 tunggu. Living. 
hal tapi iyalah keren nomor gambar tuh Okay then, Blackwell Academy was leave. I'm leaving the Blackwell Academy. Dan sekarang gue gak tahu harus kemana nih. Sekolahnya pindah kayaknya. Oh iya, barang-barangnya ini. Later, Skip. Later. Looks like David's here. Okay. Wait. wait. Where to? Wells blows the meeting. Hella. Uh, hella suck. You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, we'll get revenge. Hell yeah. Yeah, you. Yeah, I'm just in my room. He want me to send you the chain. Oh. Urgent fire weather update. I call you a bay first. What I call you bay? What fire? Okay. I've spoken. What the fuck? Please be advised that if it's moving with fire, please utilize question while traveling to and from campus. What the fuck is that? I can clear really. Oh thank goodness come home by curfew. We have the meeting early tomorrow. Chloe, you can't keep doing this to me. I'm trying to my awesome. try my best. Announcement for what? Max would have loved this shit. Okay, art should move faster. Okay. Elliot Fire Fire what? No, it's fire. I guess this fire is no joke. Still can't believe Rachel started it. Yeah, speak. Hey, Elliot. Elliot. Hi, what bitch. brings Chloe Price to school on a Saturday morning? Nothing good, I bet. I uh, was, was sus suspended. Suspended. Wait, Thank really? You. Holy shit! Holy fuck! I know. I'm surprised it took this long, too. Do you want a hug? What the fuck? Um, okay. Uh, okay. Hug to fuck, okay. Oh. Watch out your dick, dude. Watch out your dick. Thanks. Yeah, it sucks for Rachel, too. She was kicked out of the play because of me. She'll live. Harsh, man. Anyway, what are you doing here? I figured I'd see the Tempest anyway. I was going to text you, actually. I got two tickets in case you changed your mind. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks, I guess. I guess. Yeah? So you in? Might help you take your mind off things. Yeah. Why not? Guess I might as well. Could be fun to see Victoria crash and burn. Sweet. Glad I got the extra ticket. I better go. Uh, my mom is waiting to sick her attack mustache on me. Her boyfriend. Uh, don't worry about it. See you around, Elliot. See you, bitch. Yeah. Later. Bye bye, ho. Another ho. Okay. It's going to my mom boyfriend. It's going to this hole. It's about damn time. David, please. Calm down. I'll bitch. handle it. Chloe, after today. Chloe, your mother and I have been talking. 
Can, can we do this face? later? I don't think I can handle another fight right now. And who do you expect to handle things for you? Your mother? This isn't a fight, Chloe. It's a conversation. Remember that. I don't need a conversation. Not with Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Do not use that language with your mother. She's my mother. If my mother has something to say, she will say it to me. She has. The problem is, you don't listen. Maybe if you try listening to me, instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. What? Like how to have no job? Or how to be a soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. David, that's out of line. You weren't with us in there. Chloe was treated unfairly. Now you're making excuses for her? Chloe needs to take responsibility. I decide what Chloe needs, not you. Right now, what I need most of all is for the two of you to start getting along. Chloe, I care about Joyce very much. I'm willing to forgive you for the incident yesterday. If you improve your attitude going forward. Incident? What incident? I'll just say we had a rather frank discussion. But with an apology, I'm willing to start over. Sure. Sure. Reset button pressed. I am glad to hear it. From now on, I will be assisting your mother in a few areas. Like making sure that you are no longer abusing drugs or alcohol. David, do you really think now is the right time? Joyce, please. We must be a united front. Mom. Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. What the fuck? If we are going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom, you saw how I was treated in there. Now you want to treat me the same way? I don't need more discipline from you. I need my mom. I know, Chloe. And I'm sorry, but David feels... Joyce. We feel this is the best way to start fresh. Let's go, Chloe. Quit stalling. Okay. Complete. Fine. You want to see my shit so badly? Okay. Rokok spidol. HP kunci. Anjing. Edad. You know what sucks even worse than invading someone's privacy? Doing it for no reason. You're awfully smug for someone who just got kicked out of school. Oh, David. Chloe, I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? I forgive you. You were under a terrible influence. I just worry about you. But that's no excuse. Joyce, you can't start apologizing now. This will only encourage her. That's enough out of you, David. We need to start treating each other better. And that means all of us. We need a new beginning. A new chapter. One that will involve the three of us together. W what does that mean? We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. Move into what? No fucking way! Chloe, after everything that's happened, uh, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. We need a firmer hand steering this ship. 
Talk to me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. Kamu mau nikah ini orang tuanya? Bagaimana anjing? You're trying. I get you're it. You're trying. I get it. I I swear I do. And I've been making it harder for you. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. I'm sorry I took that for granted. I'm not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, 